Hi, it's Dr. C, and um, we're doing a word problem here that looks to be a binomial. So just kind of looking through it, just to kind of see what they gave us. They said 41% uh, say job applicants should follow up within two weeks. Um, sample size is nine, and we're looking for exactly seven. Okay, so I always will encourage a student to write out what's been given to us. So they gave us the probability. So P equals 0. 0.41. And then we immediately should be doing one minus P, which equals um, one minus 0. 0.41, which equals 0. 0.59. Okay, they gave us our sample size of nine. And then we're trying to find the probability of X equaling seven. So within a binomial uh, problem, binomial problems look like this. So the probability of X um, equals N given X times the probability of success X times the probability of one minus P N minus X. Okay, so also something to note, n given x equals this combination, x and then n minus x. Okay, so in this uh, binomial equation, the best way to look at this would be the probability of seven equals nine chooses seven times nine minus seven times the probability of success, which is point four one. Um, Seven times one minus point four one nine minus seven. Okay, so to kind of put more context into it, nine chooses seven. Um, is equivalent to 36 times points for one raised to the seventh equals point zero zero one nine five times one minus point four one raised uh, to the second power nine minus seven equals to the second power times point three, four, eight, one. So if we take 36 times point zero zero one nine five times point three, four, eight, one, that should give us approximately zero two four, four. We're going to round it to four decimal places or maybe five decimal places. I don't know how many your teacher wants you to round to, but we essentially are left with an answer of point zero two four four. Um, so hopefully you found this to be helpful. If you have additional questions, please feel free to reach out. Um, but this is your answer. Okay. Take care. Thank you.